I'm just going through uh, this situation right now where we ha we have a client and their CMO is uh, very experienced and is given, you know, is like, oh, this thing should be run like this. I want them run like this. And mm -hmm. our team maybe don't disagree with everything that they're saying, but it's like, we, we shouldn't just dismiss these these suggestions yeah. out of hand just because they're they're completely opposite to what we're doing like if where we can let's split test them if it's possible let's split test them and if not let's be you know let's give feedback on why we don't think that's a good idea and you know it's it's, it's not that it's not them versus us it's we're a partnership and and let's work together to figure out okay well we're what suggestions can we incorporate and test and which ones do we genuinely think are going to really affect the performance in the account i mean it's always a challenge when you work with, with clients, like ultimately it's their account, it's their business. And if they really, really, really want to try something, even though we're, you know, the experts, the ads managers are the ones running the, you know, they are the experts. Sometimes we, we have to acquiesce to what they want us to do. And then we just have to be diligent in making sure we're, we're monitoring results, making sure that we're reporting back uh, and, you know, whether this is working or not. And it's, you know, it's, it's, we talked a little bit about ego before, but like as, as when you're working with clients, it's, you just, sometimes you just have to, you, you just have to put that ego at the door and you have to be open and collaborative with, with suggestions they're making, even if you don't think they're the best idea.